What's up guys? We are in Denver, Colorado for Cedia 2023. Right now I am at the Perlisten VIP booth. So Cedia actually starts tomorrow on Thursday, but Perlisten invited me and some other people to their VIP booth tour to demo the Perlisten S7T LE limited edition speakers. I can't wait to show them to you. I've heard a lot about these speakers and I think it's gonna be a, a pretty incredible experience. So why don't we go ahead and go inside, check out those speakers. So this is Denver, guys. I am loving this city already. I believe this is downtown Denver. Again, we're at the Perlison VIP booth. So Cydia actually starts tomorrow, but we got invited to get a little demo of their new speakers that they're debuting for the first time, the Perlison S7T LE, so the limited edition. And man, I gotta tell you, this is my first time hearing them. They sound absolutely incredible. I asked Dan, Dan Romer, when he was playing some tracks, and I was like, are the subwoofers on? And his response was, what subwoofers? You gotta hear these things, man. If you can get to Cedia, or if you can get somewhere else where they're showing these speakers, you have to listen to them. It's amazing. It's only two channel, and they're streaming wirelessly. I'm assuming it's, it's high quality streams, but it was super punchy. The bass was absolutely incredible. It felt like there was two subs in the room or more. The highs were crisp. Nothing was being distorted, just absolutely amazing. So obviously, you know, I'm gonna play some demos for you guys. It's not gonna come through a YouTube video. You're not gonna get the same experience that I get, but let me know down in the comments what you guys think about the new S7 L S7T LE speakers. Do you have Perlisten in your home theater? If you do, let me know what you guys think. All right, guys, so in addition to the limited edition speakers that they had on display, they also have these prototype subwoofers. They're not even in production. They weren't even hooked up, but they had them on display. So, you know, as you can see here, you've got your 10 inch and then you have your 12 inch. You've got your 15 inch and then you've got that big boy the 18 inch. So I'm really excited about these. Now, from what I understand, these subs are on display to kind of get a feel from, you know, the public of what they think. And I think everybody likes these. And I think these were meant to be a little bit more affordable, but still in the high end. They did say pricing and I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say it, but I'll get confirmation. And if I do, I'll leave the pricing down in the comments. And again, these are premium subs. And I don't know if these are going to be THX Dominus certified. I'm assuming they will be, but I don't know. But I think that these subwoofers are going to excite a lot of people because maybe you don't want to pay the full price of their other, you know, subwoofers, the 212s, the 210s, the 215s. But you can get a couple of these and still rock the world, man. Like, I'm super excited about these. When they do release them, if they do, I think I might try to get me a couple of them. So let me know what you guys think down in the comments about these new prototype subwoofers. All right, so this sub, unfortunately, I didn't get a model number. I didn't get any of the specs. The only thing I know about this sub is that you cannot purchase this subwoofer unless you purchase the LE, the limited edition speakers that were on display. Like you can't buy this solo. You can't say, I just want this sub. You can, this sub is only accessible if you buy the limited edition speaker. So very premium. And then here's me picking up their new in-ceiling speakers, the S3IC. Man, that thing is heavy. And uh, just look at the, the girth on that thing. It's huge. This is not your typical in-ceiling speaker. There's the back of it. 
I like the look of it, man. I know a lot of people have been asking, when are Perlison going to come out with their in-ceiling speakers? Well, there it is, guys. All right, so here's a little bit closer look at the, the in-ceiling speaker. Just a wonderfully, wonderfully, beautifully made speaker. So there's, you know, one with the grill off, and then there's one with the grill on, and then later you're going to see some of the innards. But, you know, this is THX Dominus 2. It's wild to think that there's an in-ceiling speaker that can reach THX Dominus. But Perlison did it, as they always do. So, again, massive. There's the, the innards. So really cool to see, you know, what that looks like, how well it's built, premium. And then over here, some of their in-wall speakers. And this is one of the crossovers that's in the limited edition speakers. Dan came over to me. He's like, hey, man, come check this out. Yet there was actually two of them. This is the big boy. That thing is heavy too, man. So you can see how well built those crossovers inside the limited edition speakers are. And then here's just another look, a little pan of the S7T LE speakers. Again, these things were, it's its hard to describe these speakers. You know, I know I keep using incredible and amazing words that we all understand, but really you have to experience this. I, I legitimate thought that there was multiple subs on in the room. It's crazy. I see why these are Dominus rated. And, you know, they usually don't crank them up very loud at shows, but they did here and the detail was just incredibly amazing. I wish I had the name of the tracks that they played. Unfortunately, I don't, but yeah, just everything about these speakers is the real deal. TH Dominant, THX Dominus is the real deal and Perlis is the real deal, man. Love these guys. All right, guys, that's going to conclude it for the unofficial day one of Cedia 2023. Again, we're at the Perlisson VIP booth. They just debuted the Perlison S7T-LE, the limited editions. And man, these things sound absolutely amazing. I wish I had a pair to put in my home theater. But I know some of you guys have Perlison in your home theater. I'm gonna be shooting one when I get back to Houston. I'm gonna be shooting a 7.5.4 Perlison home theater. Can't wait to show you guys. So let me know down in the comments what you guys think about Perlison. If you have them in your home theater, what do you think about them? Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in the next video.